you welcome to another spirit filled message on Christocentric message if you're new to this channel I would entreat you to hit on that subscribe button and then to like this video as well I would want you to share this message across because we believe that as this message is coming forth it's going to bless you your graces are going to be imparted onto you and then God is going to visit your home thank you for watching stay blessed prayer that allows or disallows the program of God hallelujah let's pray for the sick now I want you to pay attention please please listen everyone whether you are inside or outside why is the healing ministry important I will tell you the healing ministry is important principally because God designed the human spirit to only find expression in this domain when it is in partnership with a human body. Listen carefully, please. And everybody is given one body per lifetime. You are not given the liberty of having many bodies within one lifetime. It is the exhaustion of one body that is called a lifetime. From birth till the time you transit are we together now a lifetime is not measured by longevity of time the day the physical body is exhausted your lifetime has finished even if it's one day so there are babies that have a lifetime of two hours is that true you only measure it by the presence or the absence of the health of their bodies and God so designed the spirit of man to only dwell in a body when it has a threshold level of health and vitality Please listen and learn that means when satan wants to kill you he begins by administering sickness to your body every administration of sickness is death coming to your corridors are we together now so when we pray for people to be healed it is more than validating the anointing of the man of god god is giving your body and your spirit a chance to coexist for the purpose of his program are we together why does god heal he does not just heal to reveal his love which is important he does not just heal to reveal his power which is important but he heals because if your body is dissociated from your spirit based on the law of territory you no longer has you have legitimacy to function upon the earth your spirit will have to relocate to a dimension are we together now this is very important it is the reason why no spirit functions on earth except and unless there is partnership with human bodies and the human body was so designed to have so much space in the spirit that many spirits can coexist within a human body are we together yeah it is the reason why demons clamor for human bodies they clamor for bodies but the best is the body of a human and I hope you know for you to be a human, you first have to be a spirit. You can't be a man except you are a spirit. Every man is first a spirit. Then he resides within a mortal body. Are you learning now? So when we pray for the sick and we correct by the power of God, anomalies within your body, I repeat again that it is more than just, it is an extension of your life. It is proof that God loves you. And now he's granting you a chance to leave. Resurrection is simply giving a spirit a chance to come back to a body so that it can leave. Because the spirit is not dead. But if it does not come, it cannot walk again. That is the reason why when Jesus Christ was coming from heaven the first time, he didn't have a body. God needed to partner with a woman to manufacture a body for the word called Jesus are we together and when that body came watch this now when Jesus died and resurrected you thought he would leave the body on the ground like Moses and go he went with the body again so that the next time he's coming virgin or no virgin the next time he's coming there is no discussion with anybody he can come any day because he has a body This is why we know that the return of Christ is true.
because the body he will use to return he already has so i want to pray for the sick right now please hear me it is wicked for you to think i do not need healing when you are sick sorry to be that harsh the reason is because you need to know that there are many destinies connected to you are we together now and even if you love your condition like that for the sake of those who need you man of god for the sake of those who depend on your vitality to hear the gospel you must open up yourself to be healed and listen i hope you know that even for your loved ones who are afar off like it happened to the centurion and stand by faith and believe for them are you ready for healing now now here's what i want you to do very quickly for those outside let me encourage you i do not know the condition for those outside and i want you to know that no matter what price you go through tonight i want you to know that this is a sacrifice and an investment for the sake of what god is doing in your life everybody god you uses mightily today had moments in their lives where they made sacrifices in the rain in the sun and in any condition you must love where you are going better than where you are and be willing to pay any price are we together now i'm going to pray our time is up and i need to be very fast about this i'm going to rebuke that devil of infirmity and the moment that happens i will declare your healing all those who find out that the power of god has touched them some of you i'm sure when you fell under the anointing or something happened to you there are all kinds of miracles that have happened may i request when i allow you to that you come right to my left here in the front or to my right there will be a few pastors who will take that testimony and even if it's just two or three for us to glorify jesus and then i will end up declaring over your life is that fine Please lay your hands where you are trusting God for healing. Lay your hands where you are trusting God for healing. Lay your hands where you are trusting God for healing. If it's a part of your body you cannot touch, just make contact with your chest. And then if you are standing for someone, you can make contact with your chest as a point of contact. As we worship in your presence, there is healing. The Holy Spirit's gentle touch is flowing, Jesus. We believe, Jesus. There is healing in your name. Saints and the angels bow, the redeemed worship you now. Holy, holy, holy are you, Lord. I decree and declare now, by the power that raised Christ from the dead, the power that defeated death, hell, and even the grave. In the name of Jesus who is the son of the living God I declare that every spirit that is back of any and every infirmity here represented leave now in the name of Jesus shout a believing amen leave now shout a believing amen leave now shout a believing amen leave now Now I release the power of God to your body. I declare, my God, I just sense fire leaving my hands and just touching people. Be healed right now. Be healed right now. Be healed right now. Be healed right now. Eye conditions, I declare, be healed right now. Bone conditions. You are here and you could not walk or you are using an aid. In the name of Jesus, I want you to lift it and begin to walk now. By the power that raised Christ from the dead, I pray for everyone with heart palpitations. Heart palpitations, I declare, be healed right now. 
anyone who cannot see completely or partially i bring restoration to your sight in jesus name every growth and every swelling in your body i command it to disappear now the lord is healing back pain very severe back pain be healed right now peptic ulcer be healed now please help them blood conditions you don't need to bring them out don't worry blood conditions right now i decree and declare my god miracles are happening there is someone i don't know if it's that you hit this side of your head just this side whether you hit it on a wall or is it that you fell and from that time you've been having excruciating pain the power of god is touching you right now the power of god is touching you right now there is a lady you have suffered excruciating pain on your left breast it's not like there is a swelling or something but there's been severe pain in the name of jesus that devil leaves your body now anyone here suffering the issue of blood be healed now organ failures of any sort we declare a brand new replacement now the lord is showing me someone you cannot lie down on this side of your body the left side now when you lie down you have severe pains especially around your heart region the power of god is touching you right now in the name of jesus christ everyone with a child suffering from autism at any and every level i declare be healed now be healed now deaf ears be open now there's someone your kneecap it's not like you cannot walk but severe pains around your kneecap the lord is revealing to me i decree and declare be healed right now now i want to describe someone's condition as the lord is revealing you know how you swallow something and it does not go down and you feel like something has hooked you on the throat this is how someone has been for a very long time it's like you feel that there's something there is a weight around your throat i am declaring right now the power of god is touching you shout a loud amen peptic ulcer be healed now pile be healed now in the name of jesus christ is there a woman here i'm seeing the number four four years you are trusting god for the fruit of the womb please let's not let's just let's just obey instructions i know there might be many people but this is four exactly four years is there someone like that i just want to pray for you very quickly the lord is revealing to me four years i don't know beloved in christ thank you for watching this video if you are new here too, I would entreat you to kindly subscribe to this channel for me and then hit on the like button. Also, I would want you to share this message across. I would want you to do one thing for us. Kindly tell us in the comment section where you're watching us from and you've got any testimony for us. Kindly let us know. Thank you for watching. Stay blessed. In the name of Jesus, drought in your life that even when it is physical rainy season it is still dry season spiritually financially and otherwise i decree and declare let the rain begin to fall let the rain begin to fall let the rain 